Hi, in this video I'm looking at this problem here where if it takes four years for $2,000 to accumulate to $4,000, so for it to double, if it's compounding annually, what was the interest rate per annum used? So this is a compound interest question, so we've got to recall that our compound interest rule is A, our final amount, is PR principal times by 1 plus i to the power of n. And i represents the interest rate, so that's the number that we are after. So let's have a look at our particular values that we have. a is how much we finish with, so we finish with $4,000. p is how much we started with, $2,000. N is how many compounding periods. So this is how many years multiplied by how many times it's compounding each year. But this is compounding annually, so we really only need times by one, which you don't really need to worry about because you just get four. And little i is what we're chasing. We don't know what little i is. So let's go and plug these numbers into our rule and see if we can work out i. So a comes first, our starting amount, 4,000. And that's the same as our p, our principal, 2,000. Multiplied by 1 plus this little i we're trying to work out. So we'll just leave it as i to the power of n, which is 4. So now we want to algebraically solve this question to work out what i is. So let's divide both sides by 2,000. So I'm going to have 4,000 divided by 2,000 on the left. And that's going to be 1 plus little i to the power of 4. And 4,000 divided by 2,000, well, that conveniently is 2. Because it's 4,000 divided by 2,000 is 2. So I've got 2 equals 1 plus little i to the power of 4. So now I need to deal with this power of 4. And how I deal with this power of 4 is the opposite of raising to a power is to do a root. So I've got to do a root that matches a power of 4. So I've got to do a fourth root. So I'm going to do the fourth root of 2, which mathematically is what number multiplied by itself 4 times gives us 2, but we can just chuck that into our calculator to get our answer. And that's going to be 1 plus little i. And so now all i got to do is just subtract 1 off. So little i is going to be this fourth root of 2 minus 1. And we just go and chuck that into our calculator, and that gives us a little i of 0 0.1892. But this is a decimal, and usually our interest rates are percentages, so I've got to multiply by 100 to give us our interest rate of 18.92%. And there we have it. We have the annual interest rate for $2,000 compounding annually up to $4,000 across four years. And really the key to it is a little bit of algebra, but mainly this power of four becomes a fourth root. So whatever your power is, whatever your n is, becomes your type of root. So this number just becomes the type of root. 